Hey there YouTube, this is Cactus Naga again this time with a video on uh, with a furnace problem my furnace has been blowing cold air only um, uh, it's not heating and the, the blower motor is always on so I looked it up on Google and uh, it appears that there is a fan limit switch in there somewhere that is supposed to uh, control when and at what temperatures these the fan should uh, stay on and off and things like that so apparently that can go out and cause this very same symptom I'm going to be opening up the panel now and and uh, taking a look to see if I can find and uh, check this uh, switch out I've got the front panel off I've removed the uh, I've switched off the electrical supply to it and um, the limit switch is uh, this thing down here um, it's it's got two terminals one on the top there and there's another one on the bottom there there are two terminals there and uh, according to what I'm seeing that should be normally closed um, uh, there is something that says that uh, it's uh, NC which means it's supposed to be normally closed I'm going to put my uh, meter to it and see whether it is open or closed right now so using my meter I was able to verify that the the two terminals that are supposed to be normally closed is actually open so which means that uh, the relay is or the switch is stuck open um, I'm going to be removing the the, the switch assembly from the from the chamber there and uh, for that it's just a couple of screws uh, one on the top there and one on the bottom and uh, we'll get that out and go from there well it took some doing but I managed to to get uh, get this out of there it was in there but uh, um, what had to happen was this entire um, assembly had to be moved backward a little bit and to do that I had to un unscrew these four things and slide out and push pull it out of the way so that I could get the the switch out of there the, the cutout switch um, I removed the switch and I think uh, during all the banging and all that uh, uh, the switch itself seems to have gotten unstuck again um, it seems to be testing fine I did uh, verify for uh, op operation by warming up the heat uh, the temperature sensor here over my my gas stove and it would uh, shut off and uh, it would cool down and it'll click back on so it seems to be working all right and i'm going to reinstall it and see if uh, the furnace itself starts to behave properly again um, and i don't suspect uh, i don't believe that uh, this will last very long so i'm eventually going to get this replaced with a new one I'll order this off eBay. I did see one for 25 bucks on there. So I'll get that done. I'll put this back in and um, see if that uh, if this newly reworked switch is uh, doing its job or not. Okay, I've uh, reinstalled the switch. Uh, put it back there. Reconnected it. I did clean out the contacts using some sandpaper. Um, I've uh, reinstalled the the, the gas uh, burner section that I had to remove in order to get the switch out of there. I've uh, reconnected the uh, the connections, and I am now ready to plug in the um, the electrical uh, plug-in and uh, see whether it works now. So. The heat is turning on now and the blower should momentarily switch on 
and everything should be good now. Okay, waiting for the blower to turn on. There goes the blower. So it looks like uh, it was the uh, the switch that was behave misbehaving. Uh, once it's sticky like that, it's going to stick again. I'm still going to get that replaced. But uh, that's that. Thank you all for watching.